क्या आपने कभी ऐसे रिटायरमेंट की कल्पना की है जो कॉलेज लाइफ की तरह हो वही टेंशन फ्री लाइफ मौज मस्ती और हम उम्र दोस्तों का साथ एक खूबसूरत जगह आप अपनी जिंदगी के सहेजे हुए खूबसूरत पलों को दोबारा से जिए
and uh, we are in the process of lodging a complaint, which is basically like 17 from here. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. I'm um, happy to answer any question, any information that anybody <coughs> requires. Yeah, thank, you. thank you very much, Sudeep. I think that a lot of people are here still want to understand because a lot of people from New Delhi, Haryana, Punjab, mm -hmm. many states, I don't want to discriminate the states. Yeah. A lot of people here from Uttar Pradesh and all other states. So they are here now and they have a lot of connections back home. So how they can contribute their connections and get the top players from their towns, from their areas to join the India AFL team. What is the process and how they can sort of, you know, uh, where they have to go in India, who they need to talk, yeah. and how they need to work out all these things. Right. Do you want to give some brief about it? Absolutely. Like as I said, we are already there in seven states. Um, so we don't want to spread our arms too wide. We want to stay in, you know, uh, in a position to control what we're doing. So uh, we might look at 11 to 12 states in the next three years. And uh, of course, you need, uh, without any discrimination, some really physical and so on and wealthy players uh, from up north in India. So that is really an area we're looking at, expansion in the northern part of the country where we don't exist yet. Uh, and also, if there's anyone who wants to support the states that are already there, please feel free to get in touch with myself or uh, Priyank Joksi uh, and uh, Mona Kala, who are also the board members out there at the back. We're happy to have a chat, share our emails, and uh, it will be really amazing to have the board. Like, uh, I think what you're trying to say is we are a small team doing this. If we can get your support, create a bigger team for AFL India, we can do an amazing job in the next three years. So, so did you, when you say support, can you a little bit describe to what's the definition of support in your way? What kind of, because the people are there very, they all come from a lot of a business background, and they are passionate about it, and a lot of people are here for the reason for ASL India. Losing the India doesn't make us excited, but we can next year win. There's <laughs> Pakistan, there's another problem. <laughs> but what we need to do now, how we can contribute, how these can, so when you say support, what kind of support are you looking for? So without a doubt, biggest support is the sponsorship. Um, we are still trying to raise funds for the players that have come here. It is still unpaid to where it is. And uh, for growth back in India, uh, support is not limited to just sponsorship. Even just the voluntary time to help, help establish uh, state and district associations, have a team of volunteers who can regularly help the players, get players, connect us with schools, universities, uh, sporting associations because all of those 8,500 players have come from some other sport because we don't play footy from birth like here. So everything matters. It's not just sponsorship, but also your voluntary time, um, your connections, leading us in the right way in every stage, everything matters. Well, thanks to Deepney also. I think Sudeep has given a bit of a clue if we are anybody passionate about, especially from North India, it's not just meeting other part of India. So I think you must contact Sudeep and also the other members of the the program here in Kochi, obviously. I think it's fair to say that I also like to see your view because I had an honor to meet Pakistani female team and I was amazed to hear that the female team of Pakistan come here. So Pakistanis, females, especially from that kind of a climate at the moment in Pakistan, coming to Australia and playing a AFL game, that's quite uh, incredible. And thank you for those the coaches who went to Pakistan and organized that trip and they have played here. I'm, sure, I'm not sure how many matches they have Played, but I think they participated. So, would you like to sort of give it an indication? Because we were not presenting here for female in India. So, what is the process to do also and become a female team from India? Right. So, uh, I think it's uh, great work done by Air for Pakistan, who just started activity from Islamabad last year. Uh, I've been personally been supporting Sam Shata, who's been leading the ground, work on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> because at the end of the day, we need to grow in amongst our subcontinent and India, Pakistan, Sri Lanka, Nepal, Bangladesh, having tournaments regularly instead of playing once every three years. The boys have never played in the last three years. We don't have an international match practice compared to all the other countries, but we're well in this tournament. So really want to uh, have the country to play together. But when it comes to the, the girls uh, and the women's space, uh, back in our country, this is a big responsibility, of course, I hope. You all acknowledge that. Um, so we, as I again, we don't want to have, uh, we want to, you know, have 
enough uh, capacity to work on where we are. So let's build on the, the boys sport first, get to the level, get recognized by sports authority of India, and then we can get support from the government of India. And that's when we would ideally go into the women's space. Um, we don't want to go into any publicity stunt. We want to focus on real development. So it is easy for first time in countries like Pakistan and Sri Lanka to just pick a kabaddi or a rugby or a football team, make them play footy and bring it out here. But when it comes to the growth of the game, uh, some of the boys Kevin Chiri keeps talking about, like from Kerala, they take a 44 hour long train journey to come to Calcutta for a uh, national camp. क्या आपने कभी ऐसे रिटायरमेंट की कल्पना की है जो कॉलेज लाइफ की तरह हो वही टेंशन फ्री लाइफ मौज मस्ती और हम उम्र दोस्तों का साथ एक खूबसूरत जगह आप अपनी जिंदगी के सहेजे हुए खूबसूरत पलों को दोबारा से जिए 